Hello everyone, it's Andrew Roboto here, and welcome back to Five Nights at John's, where we will be taking on Night 2, as you can tell by the screen. And you're wondering why I started right when it got to Night 2, it's because, well, this is one of the few FNAF games where it doesn't save our progress and we have to start all over again. But anyways, without further ado, we'll start Night 2 and see what it has to offer for us. And as usual, we have to wait for the screen to load for God knows how long. And, um, I... I checked out night two off camera and there's a phone guy for this night. Finally. Alright, thankfully there's a phone guy in this game. I didn't think there was for this game, but there is. Thank you. Okay, well, I could not understand a single word the phone guy said because he talked so low. But anyways, he said somewhere along the lines of check the left side of your office, which is what I'm going to do right now. Because I think someone could be coming from there. I don't know. Let me know Let me know in the comments if you can translate the phone guy. I'd appreciate that because I cannot understand a single word he is saying. This, this, this phone guy reminds me of Five Nights at Dockies and Five Nights at Mario's. Like, those were the other two games where I couldn't understand the phone guy. Like, a single word. Like, ah! What the heck was that noise? Ah! And I'm guessing we have to use the mask when he comes, when whoever comes to the left side. I guess we have to use the mask for that person. I don't know, because we have the doors to protect us too. Let me just put up the camera. I don't get why this camera won't go up sometimes. Let me check the left side. Oh, we can also move on the cameras too. Okay, perfect. That's always helpful. So let me put up the camera. Thank you. Someone's nearby. I see a pig nearby. Which he comes from, what I know, he comes from the right door. So when he arrives, we'll have to close the right door, of course. And I don't know if we have to deal with anyone at that magic cove or something, because I feel like we do, because every time you see a cove on the camera, it means like there's a foxy animatronic we have to deal with. Okay. Oh my god, I just saw a wolf at the door. Oh my god. That just scared the crap out of me. Oh my god, that gave me a heart attack. Alright, well I just closed the middle door. God, I'm trying to get back over, it's just a slow to spawn. Okay. 
Okay, I think he left. I'm not sure. Let me go check. Okay, he left good. Because a wolf was at the left door. Or I think it was a raccoon or something. I don't know who it was. So he comes from the middle door, and the pig comes from the right door, which I think i got to close now. Yep, that's because I don't think we can see him at the door. Alright, so I just closed the right door, and I also closed the left door this night. Okay. I mean the right, the middle door, sorry. I, I already closed the middle door, and now I have to, had to close the left door. Or right door, sorry. There's no left door, so you got to check through the left side. Okay, he left. Good. Check the middle hallway. Nope. No one's there. Good. Okay. Okay, let me go check the left side. Because I feel like someone could be coming through there at any night. God. Okay. Hmm. Okay, I don't know what that sound was. It sounds like a door just went down, even though I didn't close the door. Okay, I don't know why I keep hearing that noise. It, it sounds like this. I don't get why. God, why is the camera so finicky in this game? Like, like it's so very, like, like not secure when you put it off. Okay, I'll check the left side. Nope. No one there. Alright, we beat night two. Perfect. And we get a catchy tune for the clock. Yay! The kids are cheering! Alright, so, anyways, we will take on night three in the next video. Thank you for watching, everybody. Please hit the like button. Also, comment and subscribe. I appreciate all the support you have given me. And I will see you in the next video. Goodbye.